natural disasters, earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, cyclones, tsunami, floods, and drought are some of the natural disasters which may cause large-scale destruction of life and property. Now let's see how natural disasters occur. Earthquake Sudden movements under the surface of the earth may cause vibrations on its surface. These vibrations are known as earthquakes. An earthquake shakes the ground, thus shaking houses, buildings, bridges and trees. Strong earthquakes can cause severe destruction. Houses and buildings fall down, trapping or killing people inside them. Bridges can collapse and roads can develop huge cracks. Earthquakes can also cause avalanches and landslides. Cyclone Cyclone is a strong storm over a sea or an ocean. It is accompanied by strong winds and heavy rainfall in coastal areas. The strong winds cause high waves in the sea and destruction on land, while heavy rains cause flooding in coastal areas. Volcanic Eruption When molten lava, ash, dust, and gases come out of a volcano with force, it is called a volcanic eruption. Tsunami Tsunami is a Japanese word meaning harbor wave. These are very high waves that travel with great speed. They arise as a result of an earthquake or eruption of a volcano under the sea or ocean. Deep in the ocean, tsunami waves can be just about a foot high. But as they travel towards the shore, they grow in strength and height. The waves can travel very fast up to about 800 to 900 kilometers per hour and can be as high as 20 to 30 meters near the shore. They strike the shore suddenly and their force can wipe out towns and cities near the coast. Flood. In many places in our country, it rains heavily during the monsoon season. When the rivers get too much of rainwater, they overflow, causing floods. Rivers overflow their banks and spread in the surrounding areas. Floods destroy crops and wash away the homes and belongings of people. Drought. Droughts are long periods of little or no rainfall in a region. During a drought, water bodies dry up and crops fail to grow. This leads to shortage of food.